Yeah, so it's it's up to 1977. I've only been in here for a couple minutes. I'm going to take my O2. I can get my finger to read. <sighs> o two is at ninety seven. CO2, 2400. It's been, what, probably three minutes now? Mm -hmm. O2 is 96. CO2 is 2500. That's interesting. It went back down a little bit. CO2 is 2600, 2700. O2 is 97, 96. It's been about four minutes. CO2 is 2800, 2900. O2 is 96. CO2 is at 3000 ppm.
about five minutes. CO2 is 3200. O2 is 96. O2 is 97. 96. CO2 is 3300. 3400. O2 is 97. 96. It's starting to kind of feel a little more humid in here than when I first got in, so that's one difference. In fact, this, this uh, meter says its humidity is at 78% now. It's going up. Thirty-eight hundred CO two O two is still ninety seven. My guess is that'll probably lag behind quite a bit. Of course, I'm not really doing much in here; just sitting. If I were moving around a lot, it would probably be a little worse. CO two is four thousand. 81% humidity. Okay, humidity's going up. O2 is 96. It's been about seven minutes. CO2 is 4,200. Forty three hundred. O2 is ninety six. Humidity is eighty four percent. Once we hit 5,000, that's the OSHA limit that you're supposed to be exposed to for an eight-hour workday. It definitely feels muggy in here. Like, uh, if I were working right now, I would be kind of uncomfortable, would want to take a break. Almost the same feeling as if you're working like on a really hot summer day and it's humid outside. Just kind of the same. CO2, 4,800. O2 is 96. In about nine minutes. And I'm going to stop it there. It's nine minutes. We just hit 5,000. And 97 on the O2.